I was looking through news on the recreational marine industry on soundings trade only and came across an article called Diesel Outboard Set Speed Record on HV0100, whatever that is, I don't know. Cox Marine announced that it set its first diesel outboard world speed record during Speed Week on Conison Water in Cumbria County, England. On November 3rd, the Cox team and its 21-foot Hallett Vector Pegasus powered by a CXO 300 outboard hit 62.27 miles per hour. After initial runs with traditional diesel, the team switched to HVO 100 fuel, which is hydro-treated vegetable oil. Testing shows that HVO 100 reduces net CO2 emissions by 92% compared with an equivalent 300 horsepower gasoline outboard. I love these type of PR stunts. Uh, They were fun to do, and also they're very effective in getting publicity for your product. When I worked boat shows in the past showing our new four-stroke outboard, we always got the question that people came in wondering about diesel outboards. At the time, I can only think of one that was available, and it was about 30 horse. I'm thinking Yanmar, but I could be wrong. I'd have to look it up. Now we've got a 300 horsepower V8 diesel outboard. Who would have thunk? I remember hearing about this motor in the past, but hadn't heard much since. So, of course, my interest is raised on this. So I had to go check it out and went to their website and found some things and information and brochures and figured I'd go through a video on that and kind of let you know what I found out. Back in 2010, Cox Powertrain started its mission to deliver a revolutionary new concept in ultra lightweight diesel engines. This ignited the beginning of the CX-0300, a high-powered diesel outboard engine. Since then, Cox has successfully raised over 120 million pounds of private investment in order to bring the outboard from a dream to a reality. Having begun production in May of 2020, the CX-0300 is becoming hugely popular in the market and demand is only expected to rise. With experienced engineers from premium automotive combustion backgrounds, Cox took the best from the automotive world and combined it with the very best technologies from the marine industry to design and build the next chapter in diesel engines. The high-powered 300-horsepower diesel outboard engine is an innovative product offering a new marine propulsion option and is redefining standards within the maritime industry. Delivering the same performance and packaging of a gasoline outboard but with the fuel efficiency and reliability of a diesel outboard, this purposely built outboard has begun to revolutionize the market. Designed with sustainable innovation in mind, the CX-0300 is a fuel-efficient, eco-friendly diesel outboard engine designed for maximum speed. Explore the careful engineering and flawless details our designers put into this powerful outboard motor. The sleek carbon fiber cowling provides a lightweight and highly durable material for optimum strength to weight ratio with a long service life and a premium aesthetic. NEMA 2000 Electronic Control System ensures compatibility with existing industry standards, making it easy to install on a wide range of vessels. Dometic Optimist EPS Steering System The Optimus steering system increases control, comfort, and maneuverability of your vessel. Lock-to-lock turns and wheel effort are programmable to change with the engine RPM and has joystick and C-station upgrades. Now let's take a look under the cowling. Vertical crankshaft. The traditional vertical crankshaft design allows for efficient packaging and direct drive of the transmission by the crankshaft and closer transom spacing for multiple outboard installations. No mechanical fuses and relays. This module allows for active power management of the outboard power systems using CAN messages. Self-resetting fuses reduce the requirement for engine user intervention to replace physical fuses. Common rail fuel system delivers high-pressure fuel into the port and starboard common rails, which are linked by hard pipes to the top of each fuel injector. V8 4.4 twin turbo engine. 
compared to a naturally aspirated gasoline outboard, the application of two small turbochargers generates significantly more torque lower down in the engine speed range and maintains this torque across a broad range of engine speed, all the way up to full power. We'll take a look at the transom bracket. Cox Design Power Tilt and Trim Designed in-house by Cox Powertrain with high-tolerance hydraulic pistons, rod seals, and careful consideration of bearing areas and cylinder caps provide a smooth tilt and trim system. Universal Transom Bolting Pattern Easy installation onto a wide range of vessels, making repowering easier than ever. The tilt and trim seems rather limited in this demonstration, but I guess it's just a demonstration. The lower leg seems like your regular style bullet on any other outboard. Transmission, designed to handle rated speed 4000 rev minimum, rated power 300 horsepower or 224 kilowatts, peak torque 479 foot-pounds or 650 newtons. Transmission. The transmission design allows for operation in a clockwise or anti-clockwise direction of rotation and it's configured as part of the installation process. Standard propeller spline. The use of an industry standard 1.25 inch 19 tooth spline output shaft ensures both durability and compatibility with off-the-shelf hub kits and propellers. With up to 30% better fuel efficiency compared to a 300 horsepower gasoline outboard and with a service life that is three times your average outboard, the CX-0300 not only provides unique fuel savings, but it also provides exceptional total cost of ownership savings. The engine comes with a five-year, 1,500-hour recreational warranty standard. I'm sure the commercial warranty is much less. For parts and service, they have 31 distributors, 60 Cox representatives in 144 countries worldwide. I'll have to say that I like the engine. One thing I haven't found though is a cost uh, of what the price is. I'm, I'm sure I could probably dig for a little bit, but I'm kind of scared to look. Diesel engines in general aren't cheap and also, you know, today the cost of diesel fuel is way above gasoline, but that could change in the near future. One thing that does concern me is I don't see any counterbalancers or any mention of counterbalancers on this engine. A V8 in a 60 degree V configuration is not a balanced engine and you're swinging some pretty big uh, pistons there with a diesel so uh, the vibration could be a problem with this thing. Also it was uh, four valves per cylinder but I'm not sure if the engine is a two stroke diesel or a four stroke diesel. The engine prop speed is 3,700 RPMs to 4,000 RPMs. Displacement of the engine is 4.4 liters or 266 cubic inches. The weight of the outboard is 393 kilograms or 866 pounds. The bore is 3.3 inches and the stroke is 3.9 inches. And the compression ratio is 16 to 1. Hey, from what I'm seeing here, this engine looks like a winner, and I wish I had one, but uh, probably can't afford it. But it's nice to dream and nice to see new things come onto the market that you never really thought you'd see before. So more power to them, and uh, hey, thanks for watching if you made it this far, and uh, we'll catch you on the next video.